As he is a king of flips, he is also a juvenile delinquent, as you can see with that ridiculous right gyration. To right to the insult. We're not even back 60 seconds. Unbelievable. You, you, you condone those gyrations? You They're know, disgusting. I, I can have you there replaced. are children present. Can, can you move like that? Oh, you would threaten me. You would try to silence me, wouldn't you? Talk about abusing authority. God, I, I think I see you dance like that at some parties a couple months ago. Don't be ridiculous. of the sky, Raheem Royal, a man capable of feats of astonishing altitude, and also a standout from the HOG Academy student showcases. The next one of those student showcases is right here in the NYC arena, Friday, June 30th. Go to HOGWrestling.net for ticket information. He builds himself from cloud nine, Doc. Do you know what it feels like to live on cloud nine? Apparently not. <laughs> I was not going to dignify that question with a response. The next entry comes to Hogan Gore, weighing 240 pounds. The high beast of Propel. Weighing 
making his HOG debut. This man has won titles all over the East Coast. Let's see how he can do right here in House of Glory. Showcasing a lot of energy already. We're not even starting the match yet. Oh. champion in the history of House of Glory. Look at him peddling poison to impressionable, unsuspecting children. Jason, I know when his birthday comes up, we gotta get him that jacket. Oh, absolutely. I mean, I'm a little jealous. I want some of that candy over there. Yeah, you would. You would fill your body <laughs> and your mind with poison. You mean to tell me you don't hand out candy to little children on Halloween? Absolutely not. They get vegetables, as they should. Well, it's a good thing I never went by your house. Well, if you did, maybe you'd be a little bit smarter. Yeah, maybe no your brain would have developed properly. Yeah, no, thank you. Well, this is going to be the first defense of the Cruiserweight Championship since Joey Silver won that title in that gauntlet match at Beware the Fury. And listen to this crowd here at the NYC Arena. Yes, Joey Silver disguised as a cameraman last month at Beware the Fury. Hit Nolo Catano to win that Cruiserweight Championship. Well, at least Silver is now showing his true moronic self to the people instead of hiding behind some idiotic disguise. At least he's not pretending to be a law enforcement officer anymore. Well, you oh, know, look at this. Look at good, that. Good, good, excellent. Excellent. I like this Jay Bougie. He could have at least brought it over here. I would have taken it. He did you a favor, trust me. Well, ben, we, ben Rooten already starting off here. Yeah, he, Ben Rooten's ready to run. He's ready to go. We've called many, many of these matches before. We know how dangerous they can be, but how fun they can be as well. Oh, my God. Triple super kick there. Maybe not so fun for Ben Rooten. There's Jay Bougie here. Mm. It's a spin kick by Raheem Royal. And bodies are dropping left and right already in this six-way scramble. Joey Silver does not have to be pinned to lose his title. He does not. The suicidal six ways as unpredictable as they come. Darren Richardson taking advantage there and standing tall, but he's taking time for that disgusting pose. And nice. he pays for it. Nice arm drag there by Royal and Sweet Cheeks. Everyone gets an arm drag. And the last two standing here, Sweet Cheeks and Trabajador. I like this Trabajador. You would. Nice Waist move lock. there. Place lock go behind here. Joey oh. Silver's got nowhere to go. Diego blocked that last one. Sweet Cheeks escaped, but walked right into nice. a nice hip toss slam and a splash. I think Trabajador might have something loaded into that back brace there. Hey, it's not stopping his movement though, as Richardson with a tornado DDT. Richardson dazzling the, the crowd with his moves, including a pair of moves, the Tornado DDT and Red Star Press that he learned from his trainer, Amazing Red. Wow. 
Moonsault double knees to Trabajador from the infamous Darren Richardson. Here comes Raheem Roy, also very talented here. He goes up and over rolls through Richardson, hits the corner. Royal off the top. Wow, looked like they connected heads there. Evasion from both men. Royal out to the apron. And Seguri, and a sweep. Royal, nice elbow drop. Unbelievable body control by Raheem Royal in the air, hitting exactly where he wanted and to with that elbow. Sweet cheeks here. Around we go with the head scissor takedown. The down. peppermint swirl. Sorry. I love it. Yes. A little bit of showmanship. Repulsive. Monkey flip out of the corner. Cartwheel bulldog. Nice, beautiful bulldog. Wheelbarrow bulldog, I should say. And here comes Ben Rutten and Bougie. Yeah, yeah I, think they, I think they've seen it up. Doing a little bit too much showboating. That's Jay Bougie. It might be smart of Rutten and Bougie here to work together, clear out some of the other competition. Bougie has had a lot of success in teams in the wrestling world, oh. was part of the TakeOver faction. Nice DDT there by Bougie on Trabajador. Royal tried to choke out Rutten, but Rutten escaped. Springboard, wow. but Rutten caught him. Oh! The powerful Ben Rutten in full control of Raheem Royal wow. and a nice northern lariat takes him out ben of the ring. Rutten is just so vicious as Richardson comes off the top. He gets a drop kick by Bougie. Excellent timing from you know, Bougie, able to knock Darren Richardson right out of the air. It looks like Bougie here, and I mean, I, I don't know, but it looks almost like they have a little agreement together where they're not. Well, for now, for now. Oh, well, that's the end of that. <laughs> Bougie trying to get a sneaky victory over Ben Rutten. Nice. Very smart nice move. Spoke too soon. It looked like they were, and Ben Rutten's not happy about that. Oh! And he's certainly not happy about that slap I, to the face. I don't think that's very smart. Ben Rutten now. Why would you want to piss him off? Ben Rutten throwing a brutal tantrum in the ring at the expense of Jay Bougie right now. Nine bench jumps galore here by Ben Rutten as Bougie starts fighting back. Bougie was not pleased with that flurry of chops. Trying to convince them if they work together here, Ben Rutten doesn't want any part of it. Rutten smart enough not to be fooled twice by Jay Bougie. Now laying into Bougie with those chops. But Bougie comes back with a jumping punch to the face, taking out Ben Rutten. And Bougie stands tall now. Bougie, is, uh, he's been savage here in this match. But here. And Trabajador comes in with that shoulder tackle. Out of nowhere. I'm telling you, Doc, I think Trabajador's got something here. I think Trabajador, Trabajador just, flying. just used his head in the most effective wow. way he can. Richardson comes in with that double stomp there. Richardson building momentum, but also wasting time gyrating. Raheem Royal with that drop kick turns Richardson inside out. He's looking to fly now. And That's here really is some of that astonishing wow. altitude from the captain of the sky, Raheem Royal. Match is broken down all over the place at ringside. Why is Sweet Cheeks talking to Nick Shin? He wants to give him candy. He's going to bribe him, isn't he? Nick Shin is hungry. Yeah, and, and Joey Silver's going to take advantage and bribe the official so he can cheat again well, look, and steal another victory. He, he, he removed that lollipop uh, from a very uh, private place. Oh, oh God, it must smell maybe, horrible. Maybe we should go down there and get you one. Too. That's disgusting. And now, Joey Silver using the official for an unfair advantage. Look at Sweet Cheeks with the assist from Nick Shin. Lewdly walking across the top rope. And the in 
imbeciles in attendance eat it up like so many sugary treats. Speaking of eating it up, I can't believe Nick Shin still has that in his mouth. It was right. He's probably at <laughs> I don't worst know what things there. I can't tell. And Joey Silver, this crowd is loving it. Silver in the corner. And another one. Taking Ben Roon on a trip to Candyland here. The silver two. Ooh. Two and a half. Roon kicks out. Some of the, introduced Rootin to some of that candy you know what. But Rootin reversing. Lost Sunset over. flip. But Rootin is not being taken over. Rootin is a big man, silver. That's Rootin now. Going for a back, oh, oh backbreaker. Wow. It's just backbreaker by Ben Rootin. And then a back suplex into a Uranagi. Devastating attacks from the hype beast Ben Root. And that's the closest anybody has come so far to possibly winning that Cruiserweight Championship. That's Trabajador now. Sneaking up on Ben Rutten. Nice hot suplex dropped Rutten right on his head to Diego El Trabajador. Raheem Royal now. He ducks that clothesline. Pele, Pele kick. kick. Yes. That's Raheem Royal now signaling. He might want that 450. He's defeated several opponents with that. Exactly. Nailed it. Picture perfect as Richardson now. Not wow. enough to beat Trabador. And now, oh. Left. oh! Raheem Royal left vulnerable for that corkscrew leg, leg drop. drop. Absolutely he devastating. And Bushi was a springboard cutter. He goes for a cover of Richardson, too. As Silver broke that up. Royal was able to kick out of that maneuver earlier from Richardson, but he might be hurt. Richardson came down right on Raheem Royal's head with his leg. And Richardson now's got someone's shoes. He's got a pair of kicks. I know, that's right. As the kids say. Big spear from Bougie to Rootin. Now, yeah, don't waste your time with sneakers. Sweet sheets now. Candy Crush on Jay Bougie nailed him. And that's it. Oh.